the way I operated, you don't want to hurt somebody. You don't want to put them, you don't collect your money like that. If they don't have the money, they don't have it. Most of the time, a gambler, if they have the money, they want to pay you because they want to gamble again. If somebody doesn't have the money, what's the sense of putting them in the hospital or breaking their legs like we hear all the time? That doesn't happen all the time. The only time that happens is if somebody's making a total fool out of you. If they're gambling with you, saying they don't have the money, then they go to the bookmaker across the town and they start putting money down with him. If it gets to where this guy, he just is not going to learn his lesson, then it could be a problem for him. Now, when it comes to an athlete, it's a whole different story because an athlete has something to offer. You know, they could shave points in a competition. They can offer inside information that can help you, you know, in your gambling situation, give you an edge when you're betting. So somebody like that, you want to cultivate. You don't want to hurt. You want to cultivate them. You want them to work for you. So you put them in a compromising position and you say, now this is one way for you to get out of it.